You are in Survival Craft broadcasting a distress message. What information would be essential to your rescuers? A. The nature of the distress. B. The time of day. C. Your radio call sign. D. Your position by latitude and longitude. The answer is. D. Your position by latitude and longitude. Information on safety and hazard control particles and procedures on a vessel is described in. A. Your employment contract. B. The vessel's logbook. C. The instruction written on life buoys. D. The vessel's safety management manual. The answer is D. The vessel's safety management manual. Which of the following is considered to be the safest protection from static electric discharge when connecting or disconnecting cargo hoses and metal arms? A. Insulating flange or a length of non-conducting hose. B. Switching off ICCP. C. Shipshore bonding cable. D. None of the above. The answer is C. Shipshore bonding cable. A emergency station list should be displayed on any vessel with more than A. Four crew members. B. Ten crew members. C. Three crew members. D. One crew member. The answer is A. Four crew members. Life jackets are kept A. In overhead lockers. B. Out of harm's way in the wheelhouse. C. In the plastic bag to prevent mold. D. Where they can be easily seen and accessed. The answer is D. Where they can be easily seen and accessed. In a distress situation, how many times or for how long should the emergency alarm signal be sounded? A. Three times. B. Three minutes. C. Until all crew members and passengers have reported to their respective muster stations. D. Until the emergency is over. The answer is C. Until all crew members and passengers have reported to their respective muster stations. Life jackets should be marked with a dash. A. Maximum weight allowed. B. Stowage space assigned. C. Vessel's home port. D. Vessel's name. The answer is D. Vessel's name. What is the life-saving signal at day for you? Are seen assistance will be given as soon as possible. A. Green star rocket. B. Red star rocket. C. Orange smoke signal. D. Horizontal motion of flag. The answer is C. Orange smoke signal. The receiver misunderstood the sender's message and A. This could lead to effective communication. B. This could lead to a barrier to effective communication. C. This could lead to wonderful communication. D. None of these. The answer is B. This could lead to a barrier to effective communication. Empathetic listening helps you to A. Improve mutual understanding and trust. B. Improve mutual understanding. C. Improve mutual understanding and feeling. D. Improve trust and friendship. The answer is A. Improve mutual understanding and trust. The problem of misunderstanding can be eliminated by providing dash to the clients. While explain in the process. A. Theories. B. Examples. C. Sample. D. Maths. The answer is B. Examples. Name of two officers who liaise with each other to try out the steering gear. A. Chief engineer and chief officer. B. Second engineer and second officer. C. Third engineer and third officer. D. None of these. The answer is C. Third engineer and third officer. Speech rate is usually much underscore than the rate at which we think. A. Tedious. B. Slower. C. Faster. D. None of the above. The answer is B. Slower. In verbal communication process, the direct exchange of occurs between the sender and the receiver. A. Nails. B. Words. C. Gestures. D. None of the above. The answer is B. Words. What is discrimination? A. Making false statement about others. B. Making judgments or statements based upon making comparisons. C. Judging people discriminately. D. Making hateful content. The answer is 
be making judgments or statements based upon making comparisons. In the event of a person falling overboard, you would a. Encourage passengers to jump in to rescue the MOB. b. Ask passengers to stand back to allow crew to manage emergency. c. Jump overboard to rescue the MOB. d. Push the passengers into the cabin and lock the door. The answer is b. Ask passengers to stand back to allow crew to manage emergency. In the event of a small rubbish bin fire in the accommodation, you would a. Shout fire. Fire so all the passengers in the cabin hear you. B. Go to see the skipper to ask his advice. C. Pick it up and run with it to the outer decks. D. Cover it with a fire blanket. The answer is D. Cover it with a fire blanket. Communication between member of a firefighting team. A. Must be by hand signal to avoid smoke inhalation. B. Are not possible when using breathing apparatus. C. Must be clear, detailed, acknowledged, and timely. D. Must be clear, concise, acknowledged, and timely. The answer is D. Must be clear, concise, acknowledged, and timely. After having activated the emergency position indicating radio beacon, epirb, you should dash. A. Turn it off for five minutes every half hour. B. Turn it off and on at five min intervals. C. Turn it off during daylight hours. D. Leave it on continuously. The answer is D. Leave it on continuously. After being launched, a totally enclosed lifeboat, which has been afloat over a long period of time, requires dash. A. Frequent opening of hatches to permit entry of fresh air. B. Regular checks and pumping out of the bilge levels. C. Use of earplugs to dampen engine noise. D. Frequent flushing of the water spray system with fresh water. The answer is B. Regular checks and pumping out of the bilge levels. Most enclosed lifeboats will automatically right themselves if they capsize. This will occur when which of the following conditions exist: A. The lower ballast tanks are filled with water. B. The fuel tanks are not less than half full. C. The passengers are trapped to their seats. D. The sea anchor is deployed to windward. The answer is. C. The passengers are trapped to their seats. How many VHF survival craft transceivers are required aboard passenger ships? A. Two. B. Three. C. Four. D. Five. The answer is B. Three. Under STCW regulation, what must each new crew member do before commencing assigned duties? A. Locate his working area and working clothes. B. Read all posted notices slash regulations carefully. C. Be familiar with safety procedures. D. Report to the master for signing on the ship's articles. The answer is C. Be familiar with safety procedures. You are standing in the wheel watch when you hear the cry, "Man overboard, starboard side!" You should instinctively dash. A. Give full right rudder. B. Give full left rudder. C. Put the rudder amidships. D. Throw a life ring to mark the spot. The answer is A. Give full right rudder. Your vessel is equipped with totally enclosed lifeboats. Which statement is true when the boat is enveloped in flames? A. A water spray system to cool the outside of the boat is operated. B. An air tank will provide about 10 minutes of air for the survivors and the engine. C. The ventilators will automatically close by the action of fusible links. D. The motor takes its air supply from outside the lifeboat to prevent asphyxiation of the crew. The answer is B. An air tank will provide about 10 minutes of air for the survivors and the end. What governs safe procedures at work? A. The International Convention on Standards of Training, Certificate and Keeping for Seafarers (STCW). B. International Safety Management. ISM Code Safety and Health C Occupational Act OSHA D The Code of Safe Working Practices The answer is D The Code of Safe Working Practices How do you combat harassment A By being assertive B By reporting harassing behavior to your superiors C By confronting the harasser D None of these The answer is A By being assertive What is the key to leadership? 
A. Taking authority. B. Taking responsibility. C. Effective communications. D. None of these. The answer is C. Effective communications. Human elements in ship means A. Human behavior. B. Human relationship. C. Human interaction. D. Human error. The answer is A. Human behavior. Displacement refers to the dash. A. Cubic capacity of a vessel. B. Dead weight carrying a vessel. C. Gross tonnage off a vessel. D. Number of long tons of water displaced by vessel afloat. The answer is D. Number of long tons of water displaced by vessel afloat. The international distress, safety and calling frequency is channel dash A. 16. B.18, C.22, D. 13. The answer is A. 16. If more than one life raft is manned after the vessel has sunk, what action will aid in your recue? A. Each raft should go in a different direction in search of land. B. The possibility of a search aircraft finding you is increased by spreading out. C. Tie each of the rafts together and try to stay in a single group. D. Reduce the number of life raft. The answer is C. Tie each of the rafts together and try to stay in a single group. When should the control of flooding of your vessel be addressed? A. Only if a threat exists. B. Following control of fire. C. Following restoration of vital services. D. First. The answer is, B. Following control of fire. A motor lifeboat shall carry sufficient fuel to operate continuously for a period of which duration? A. 12 hours. B. 18 hours. C. 24 hours. D. 23 hours. The answer is, C. 24 hours. Life buoys are subjected to which of the following tests? A. Crop test. B. Fire test. C. Flotation test. D. All of the above. The answer is, D. All of the above. After being called to muster stations, if some time will elapse before abandonment, the master should ensure that all passengers and crew? A. Have a glass of whiskey to keep them warm. B. Go to the toilet before abandoning. C. Choose the life raft they want to go into. D. Have a good drink of water and collect grab bags and warm clothing. The answer is, D. Have a good drink of water and collect grab bags and warm clothing. A person who sees, someone fall overboard should, dash. A. Go to the bridge for the distress flares. B. Run to the radio room to send an emergency message. C. All for help and keep the individual in sight. D. Immediately jump in the water to assist the individual. The answer is, C. Call for help and keep the individual in sight. Welding shields primarily protect against A. Dust B. Metal splatter C. Splashes The answer is B. Metal splatter The safe and efficient use of the face piece of A. Demand type self-contained breathing apparatus is directly influenced by A. The downing of the face piece B. The stowing of the face piece C. The maintenance of face piece D. All of the above. The answer is, D. All of the above. Information on fire safety and hazard control practices and procedures on a vessel is described in A. The engine room log. B. The vessel safety management. C. The bar diary. D. The instruction written on fire extinguishers. The answer is, B. The vessel safety management. What term indicated an inward curvature of the ship's hull above the waterline? A. Camper B. Tumble home C. Dead rise D. None of these The answer is B. Tumble home Compared to oil tankers, chemical tankers are A. More complex to operate B. Less complex to operate C. As large as oil tankers D. Capable of carrying only one grade of chemical? The answer is A. More complex to operate. 
In the concept of ship handling, what would be the definition of shallow water? A. Water depth of less than twice a vessel's draft. B. Water depth of less than one half times a vessel's draft. C. Under keel clearance of twice a vessel's draft. D. Under keel clearance of less than 10 feet. The answer is A. Water depth of less than twice a vessel's draft. Which engineering staff is in charge of engine room maintenance? A. Second engineer. B. Chief engineer. C. Third engineer. D. Master. The answer is A. Second engineer. Physical stress. A. Rarely causes emotional stress. B. Is often a symptom of emotional stress. C. Rarely is connected to diet. D. Is often found in people who exercise regularly. The answer is B. Is often a symptom of emotional stress. Self induced stress is mainly due to A. Family. B. Personality. C. Economy. D. Health. The answer is B. Personality. One of the most important factor determining the success of an organization is A. Effective management. B. Continuous and positive profits. C. Performance of its employees. D. Methods to combat internal personnel stress. The answer is C. Performance of its employees. Direct blood contact through all except A. Needle sharing. B. Transfusion. C. Sharing of beds. D. Accident in healthcare settings. The answer is C. Sharing of beds. When a fuel oil is being topped off during bunkering operations, the tank value should enclose A. Slowly to prevent surge stresses. B. To prevent gas from escaping through the pressure vacuum relief valves. C. After the shore pumps are stopped. D. Rapidly to prevent overflow. The answer is B. To prevent gas from escaping through the pressure vacuum relief valves. Oil pollution regulations any transfer or discharge of oil or oily mixtures be recorded in the A. Pollution control record. B. To prevent gas from escaping through the pressure vacuum relief valves. C. After the shore pumps are stopped. D. Rapidly to prevent overflow. The answer is C. After the shore pumps are stopped. Ground garbage, which will be discharged into C, must be able to pass through a screen with a mesh size no longer than dash. A. 25 millimeters. B. 50 millimeters. C. 75 millimeters. D. 100 millimeters. The answer is A. 0.25 millimeters. Answering signals made by life saving stations when signal seen from a ship by day are A. Orange smoke signal. B. Parachute rocket. C. Hand flare. D. Second officer. The answer is A. Orange smoke signal.